are turned in here tonight. That is what they will be. EA Sports. It's in the game. All right, coming up next is the UFC Heavyweight Showdown. This guy has truly made the takedown a thing of beauty in mixed martial arts with respect to yourself and George St. Pierre and the truly great takedown artists. This guy's closing the gap and, and entering that company in the eyes of men. Oh, absolutely, because he's done such a great job of timing takedowns. You didn't see, I haven't seen anyone so good at slipping a jab into a takedown since George St. Pierre. Right. He does a phenomenal job of getting from step one to step two before his opponent even realizes, now he's in on my leg. And if they do get their hip back, immediately he's up into a foot seat, or a headlock, or an inside trip. It's just so many different ways for him to get you to the floor that he will throw every single one at you every single time. And a lot of fighters talk about that wrestling maintenance and how hard it is, right, over the course of a career to continue to drill those things. He talks a lot about that, and that's why he's continued to realize success here in the U.S. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times. Enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best. Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Herb Dean. Now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 148 pounds. Fighting out of Atlanta, Georgia, the assassin. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves is not going advantage but we know what a high level striker is and this guy is as high level as we've ever seen in the UFC. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Big power shot there. He's hurt bad. He is throwing a fast straight hard jab. Finish could come here at any time. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Oh, effective strike there by Lee. Real quick leg kick. Well, 
perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Punch is blocked. How about that shin? Big leg kick land. Trying to establish that jab once again. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Wow, actually got the takedown. All right, so he postures up here and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. Oh, nice job to get back up again. You don't want to hang out on the ground with this guy. Tags him with the overhand. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, huge kick to the body. That can't feel good. Single collar tie here. Lee gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. And he landed the right hand there. That was a thudding leg kick. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Oh, he got that inside leg kick to the target there, DC. You don't want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. It starts to beat up the inside thigh. That is a technique you use to really slow down your opponent. Body kick is blocked. to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC, talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. You ready to fight? Ready. All right, let's get to round two. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Good punch, Lance. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Look at 
Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick, yep. Yeah? Big head kick land. The right hand just misses. Nice punch there by Lee. Oh man, how many head kicks can one man absorb before getting separated from his conscious? One, normally. <laughs> this guy has a great chin, but if he takes any more, he's gonna be sleeping. Able to check the high kick. Look at that switch knee, beautiful switch knee. Just misses there with the left. Beautiful strike. Hands high, hands high. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. Just over three minutes now to go. Just out of the range with that oh, right hand. That's a big takedown. Is this the one that's gonna break him? All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hit the skate. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Oh, nice job using his strength there to posture up. We'll see what he can do now. He's gonna start looking to land big shots from the top. corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Lee's head kick is blocked, so no damage. Oh, lands and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. You know, that's, that's a big thing whenever you're blocking high kicks, man. You cannot just take the brunt of that kick on one arm. You have to get that cross arm to try and guide that kick so you don't take all of it. Lee gets caught with that punch. Not the easiest guy in the world to hit, but he got caught there. Just missed with the left there. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Ooh. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Venturing in on a single leg takedown attempt here, and he is able to get the fight where he wants it. Nice job there. The moment he secures that single leg, you can see how comfortable he is and the variety of finishes he has from this position. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Nice punch land over the top. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Nice leg kick land. Well, that nose isn't going to be able to take too many more as he doubles up on the jab there. So good to watch MMA fall and watch guys now fight behind the jab. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. There. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, on his first test in elementary school. All right, let's get you some of the action from that previous round, DC. And those are some serious leg kicks, man. He gets the leg to the target so quickly. He gets his foot off the ground so quickly. 
that you don't even recognize that it's coming. And that's really confusing as a point. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous round, and he'll look to keep it going here. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kick. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Well, not only has he stayed aggressive as he was in the previous round, landing a high volume of strikes, but he's also been efficient, not just with his strikes, but also with his body movement. Complete performance out of this fighter here tonight. Straight punch lands. And that left hook landed on the button. Lee gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can rally. Hey, soft balance. Take him down. Here's the shot. Oh, take the shot. Well, he keeps going back to the well with that left hand just out of range. That one snuck in. Nice strike. And both guys really throwing with authority. lands another strike to the body. He just continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. And now he goes with the combination of punches to the head, potentially some concussive damage there. I mean, absolutely concussive damage. Landing all those strikes to the head. He's very accurate, he's very fast, and he has a real confidence every time he throws his punches. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Connects with a right. Lee's strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Nice kick. He's got to go chase that finish down. Oh, is that a big knee to the body? We'll see if he can follow up. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if he can follow it up. He's landed that punch over and over again. What's he going to do to follow up? Oh, that right hand is on point. Just missed with that right hand. And nice job to land the knee there by the taller fighter. And I think I just heard Daniel Cormier say, I wish I was a little bit taller. You're a baller, though, DC. Score that just out of range with that left hook. Can't take many of those. You better check. Oh, man, that left side is getting beat up now. Look at the redness there. His opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Try to establish that jab. Head kick there blocked by Lee. Great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very active. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. Oh, man, that couldn't have felt good. Flush knee lands to the body by the taller fighter. Oh, he 
he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. Certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. What a tricky head kick. How good is that right How about those five All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action, but the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed, that put him on wobbly legs, and in survival mode, luckily he made it to the end of that round. Let's slow it down just a little bit. You ready to fight? Ready. Go. Fourth round, fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. I know you love the jab. That was a nice one. It's my favorite punch in all the fighting. Oh, he hurt him bad with the jab. Able to check that kick as well. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. It's such a fast leg kick. Effective punch there by Lee. Oh, that left hand is money tonight. Come on, buddy, keep your hands. It's very tricky when he throws that body. Nice kick. combination of kicks there by Lee. Just over three minutes to go. Big and kick. All right, less than three minutes to go here in round number four. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Lee. Nice loop and punch. Starting to take its toll here. Obvious redness on that right side. Bar working out of side control here. His opponent trying to control posture, but you got to be careful here. Oh, he postured up there, gained some valuable separation. And now the ground and pound starts. Oh, nice work from the bottom. Tags him with the punch. Oh, big combination of ground and pound strikes here, DC. This could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you gotta be very careful when you take these big ground and pound strikes. You need a controlled posture on the bottom. And if you're the top guy, the guy that's looking to finish, continue to gain posture and bring down big strikes in your point. So, fighter a little bit stunned, holding on to him now, not doing a ton, just looking to recover. Bone on bone, shin slash foot, right to the skull. You see why I'm a commentator and not a fighter? You see why? Yeah, those are fun. Um, oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, straight right. That one was thrown to end the fight. Yep. <laughs> 
Still nice body kick lands. All right, he engages in the single power tie. Ooh, what a punch. Just misses with the straight left hand. Big leg kick land. Nice kicks there by Lee. Well, he is at his kickboxing best tonight. Another nice, good series of kicks by him there. I mean, the kicks are coming in bunch of marks. Beautiful combination to get the knockdown. Both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but what a fight so far! All right, so there's the end of the round, and the tide has officially turned a huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment to try to change the tide of this fight. Straight punch there, DC. We'll see if he can follow it up now. He has been throwing this strike over and over again. Look how crisp and straight he is. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, oh. no soda. It's one and done. We're off in the nut. John, don't you come to me without a combo. I want the whole <laughs> platter. Give him the whole platter, young man. Put some punches together. Make this guy take the whole thing. Give him more than one strike. You have now found the set of punch. The jab is landing consistently. Find something that's going to go behind it. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. And now he's in a lot of danger. He's got to grab that head or he's going to get blasted. All right, bottom fighter here. Maybe looking to hip escape, DC. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Close guard. Well, any time you are in a ground fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. He's done, he's done. You knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent, but that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the huge knockout victory. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop for this contest at one minute, 39 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon! There will be no shutting that smile off tonight. The celebration is on as he gets a huge win by knockout tonight. I got to think there are a few better feelings in the world than walking into an octagon and candidly knocking another man out. Yeah, you shut a person's lights off, man. There's nothing like it. Now, I understand a lot of times we hold